My dear friend, press on to victory. Victory is in Jesus. I bring you greetings from Calvary Baptist Church. This is Pastor Fred Digby. Welcome to a new year. Welcome to a new month, 2021. By God's grace, you and I have arrived in it. Our clue for surviving this year is what I choose to title the Veterans Testimony. Veterans are people who have seen wars, they've seen troubles, they are so experienced that when things are happening, they know because they've survived terrible things, they will survive in the future. The psalmist said, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. For David, the one who is leading him and the one who should be guiding you is David's Lord. He's a mighty conqueror. He's a provider. He's your all-sufficiency. He's the one who has granted you the gift of this year. And therefore, thank him that because he's given it to you, he's not finished with you yet. He will take you through to the end. He said, I am his sheep. Oh, for David, who has been a shepherd, he knows how sheep can be confused, how they can be misguided, or how they can be sidetracked. I say, because the Lord is my shepherd, I'll cling close to him. Would you follow the Lord this year in prayer, in devotion, in faithfulness, in giving him your time, your treasure, and your talent? That is what the sheep do. They give the shepherd their attention. And because of that, they know they'll move from one destination to the other. Whether they are lions or pools or thorns at the side, it is none of their worry. This I shall not want. You know, the last part of that says, even though I pass through the valleys of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil because the Lord is with me. Yes, the same God who has taken you from January to December last year is the same God who will take you from January to December this year. He knows what is at the beginning. He knows what is at the end. And therefore, join me and join the psalmist to give this testimony. Because God is my shepherd, I will lack nothing. I will go through this year by his grace, by his provision, and by his anointing and the leading of his spirit. Stay blessed and have a spirit of expectancy. In Jesus' name, this is your story. Shalom. Stay blessed. Amen. Amen.